My legs move so fast, but I go nowhere. Less coldness in your punch pail. Oh. Why are you taking me? Why? 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 You must be old school. You said tape. <laughs> <laughs> Do you rewind DVDs? <laughs> <laughs> so, part of your tour of the new house, as I promised. Uh, we got a few cool things going on around here that we've done. We've completed a lot of stuff on our own. Like I said before, I'm a do-it-yourself kind of guy. So I have done a lot of stuff myself in this house and it really makes me feel good. Uh, one of the cool things that we got here, we got this nice patio set. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. And we replaced this old barbecue thing here, which I do like uh, charcoal grills, but you know, I had to get this bad boy right here. Yeah. Bam! So much better. What an upgrade. Look at that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's this, uh, this right here. Infrared. And it's really cool. It's got these, uh, little things here underneath the, uh, underneath each piece to help keep the flames from shooting up and burning all your food, which is pretty much horrible. So, yeah. So I'm going to turn it on real quick here while I'm getting ready to, uh, get some barbecue going on for dinner tonight. We've been we've we've had this thing for like a week and we've used it like five times already. So yeah, we love it. And yeah, I gotta start it. So I'm gonna turn it on here. And uh, I'll show you some of the other nifty little things that uh, we have been doing around the house. Okay, okay. Um, I rebuilt part of the fence that was broken. I'll show you that. You can see some of these old dark brown pieces. Now there's a nice little angled corner that uh, looks brand new. I put up some cedar fence planks. The whole the whole piece had fallen down. I don't know if I showed you that in my old video of the house, but um, the old fence had fallen down and it needed to be replaced. So I replaced it myself. I ain't paying somebody a couple hundred bucks just to stick that up. There's a couple of uh, fence boards up there that look brand new. Uh, I put those in. There's one behind the tree there that you can't see. I put those in too, and it feels good. It feels good. So, I'll give you a tour of inside the house as well as outside the house. And you can see what the whole thing looks like. Good stuff! <laughs> yeah! Let's look at some exciting new wall art. Doo -doo. Pears and apples. They're good for your body. hot dogs for dinner. I've made uh, a lots of stuff on here already so I figured I'd switch it up. Uh, we've had hamburgers, we've had pork ribs, we've had chicken, we've had hamburgers a couple times. So I decided to throw down on some hot dogs. Just some plain old simple Oscar Mayer wieners. Yeah. Sponsor! Not sponsored. That'd be nice though, huh? Anyway. Yeah, look at that. They're looking good. Looking good. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. I love when they get those little lines on them. The grill marks. Love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So. Who else out there has a new place to live? How do you decorate? 
do a video response. I haven't seen any video responses on my channel ever, so be the first to do a video response. <laughs> That's the challenge. Who's gonna do it? Who's gonna do it? This is a vlog. A vlog about a new house. A new house. A new house. This vlog is very entertaining. Or maybe not so much. But you'll probably watch it anyway. Here's our house, check it out. This is the outside of the new house. Check it out, look at that really cool car. Did y'all wish you had that car? And then there's this car. Our lawn is like struggling at the moment. So, you know, look, it's kind of brown and not so green. And we got these little clover leaves that are popping up everywhere. Not clover leaves, but the little clover flower things. We mow them, and like three days later, they're all back. So, I don't know what to do about that. But, here's the house. We got a brand new roof put on this thing. It was worth $5,000, and we had to have the bank pay for it. Otherwise, we weren't going to be able to do it. And they finally agreed to pay for the new roof. So, the new roof looks really cool. And, uh, we got this big old palm tree in the front of our house. It's kind of cool looking, but it's kind of high maintenance. It takes a lot of, you, know, you got to cut all the branches down and climb up the ladder to get to it and whatever. But it's kind of cool looking, so it might be worth it to have it up there, at least for a few more years till it gets way too tall. Um, and the place came with a bunch of rose bushes in the front. And they, uh, there's actually a couple of good little sprouty flowers that came out, and they looked pretty good. They're, they're kind of dying in the summer heat, but they look pretty. They look nice. They look very nice. Look at that. Whew. There's more. Oh, yeah. Who wants to receive some of those flowers, yeah? All right. Now, here's the front view of the fence that I did. All right, look at that. I built that from top to bottom there. Bing. All those. And there's cedar. I love the smell of cedar. It smells so good. I'm going to go smell some. Smell some cedar. You can still smell the cedarness of it. It's very cedar. And I've been walking on this poor bush. You know, it's like flattened out because I had to keep walking on it to bring all the boards in and everything. Sorry, I don't know what to do about it. They're just squashed. But they'll probably uh, fix up once we start working on the yard and then we'll spruce it up and we'll water it and do all the stuff we're supposed to do to make it look nice. So uh, that'll be coming. All right. Now, I'll just show you the lights we got. We, I love these little uh, LED solar powered lights. Here's the other side of the house. We got this big old swinging fence. Almost all those boards were loose and I had to hammer them all back in. So, yeah. As you may remember, I uh, did a lot of the work in the, in the house too, like uh, installing the toilets. I actually still have some parts of the toilets out here in the front yard. I just don't know what to do with them. Am I allowed to throw them in the trash can? I don't know. So, we'll figure that out. Maybe I'll do a funny skit with toilets or something. Uh, anyway, that's the outside of the house. And we'll show you some more footage of inside the house once we finish organizing a few more things. We want it to look decent before we go showing it off. So, that's that. Alrighty. Thank you very much. So, Carolyn's out watering the lawn. And it looks like our neighbor across the street is copying us. Yeah, they are. I don't know if you can see them. But they are also watering their lawn. Copycats. It's the battle of the lawn waterers. Carolyn versus them. Do 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 do. I think we're winning. Yeah. Pause for breakfast. <laughs> Kellogg's Ego Syrup. Sponsor.
In the parking garage. In the parking garage. In the parking garage. <laughs> I missed most of the good stuff. I missed all the good stuff. <laughs> so we're here to see Brian Regan. Last minute notice, but we're here. Is that too close? Okay. I wonder if you can even hear it. Ryan Regan, funny comedian. If you can hear me on the blogger. We made it, my brother invited me. Goodbye. I'm filming the lady that has the sign that says no cameras. muffins with cheddar cheese mild or medium or mild one of those medium cheddar cheese mm. and 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 hash browns <laughs> hash brown that's better than going out to fast food for breakfast. Yeah, yeah. You don't even have to leave home. We're monkeying around with the monkeys. Hey, hey, they're the monkeys. <laughs> this one looks like a skunk. Look at this. He's not, face, he's not a skunk. <laughs> Wanna get a door look? Oh, you can learn how to train your dragon. Right here. I think it's actually the story. I personally don't have the memory that you have, so... That's a purse! That's my purse. I put my coins in it. Wesley, Maria, you want to be a Maria for the day? Maria. Maria, Maria. Oh, copyright. <laughs> Riley, that's a cool name. I don't have Riley, but they don't have Carolyn. Mm. Is it Erica? We can take off the A and it can be Eric. <laughs> from my brother's name. <laughs> That'd be funny, we could do something with that. <laughs> Just Gross. Oh, they have this stuff. I'm in travel size. Now I can spike my hair when I'm traveling. Cool. Can you see? No. Pig's feet. Ew. These are good. They're chocolate with oh, yummy. mega fudge. Me. Wanna get one? Whiteness and darkness and redness. <laughs> oh, yes. Darkness, redness, and whiteness. We should yeah. get one and send it to Toby. Chips Ahoy of darkness, redness, and whiteness. We could get tea biscuits and have them with tea. Tea biscuits with tea. Potato pancake mix? Mmm. Interesting. Never had a matzo ball. You ever had a matzo ball? What's a matzo ball? It's right here. Matzo ball. Nope, never had a matzo ball. This stuff looks good. Israeli couscous. Hmm. They have some shish kebab on there. Shish kebab. 
That looks pretty good. Shish kebab. We're at Brandy Creek, and Brandon needs my help at Brandy Creek. And we're blowing up this big old humongous ginormous ginormo graphical raft and raft raftosaurus rex that's like really big. I need you to lift and, it so it's not dragging it on the ground. And I'm gonna be done vlogging for a moment. Putting on the spray, sunblock spray. Proof that I use it <laughs> in case I get burnt. To yeah, yeah. A fry. To a fry. To a fry. Here's Crackman. Crackman. <laughs> Oh, you having fun? All right. Blowing up the island over here. It's pretty sweet. It's like, uh, you know, I showed it already. That's the, uh, it's like an island. We can all sit on it and the water. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's pretty cool in Redding, yeah. So, um, yes. Well, so you might have seen some of the footage. I didn't get much because we went to we went to see Brian Regan last night, and he is hilarious. He knows how to keep it clean and still be funny. You know, he uses humor without like cursing it up. So uh, it's pretty cool. We went and saw him last night, and it was awesome. And uh, they were walking around holding signs that said no cameras, and I tried to film the lady that was walking around with that sign and didn't get very far. So, and it was pretty dark in there. So, sorry we didn't get any cool footage there. But now we're at Brandy Creek in Redding, California. It's a beautiful view. We got mountains, we got the water. I, you, I know you can see all the cars right now, but I'll get some more footage when we get down there. And uh, it looks pretty cool. So, yes. Yes. Enjoy. You like my little hat? I got the hat, I got the, the water shoes. Looking pretty cool here. And good times. Here's what we're rafting on. That's pretty big. Pretty big. Well, you tell me what to do with me. Big as like two cars across. Pretty big, huh? Yeah. Here we are at Brandy Creek. And it's getting dark. Say hi to the camera. Hello, camera. Hello, you're too close. Hello, that's perfect. Now we got scenery in the back. And Sarah in the front. Hey. See Brandon, he's looking for an open grill, but he's just kind of standing there. Middle of nowhere. Don't know what he thinks he's going to find. The way that he's standing there. He needs to go out a little further. But here we go. You see him yet? You see him yet? You see him yet? I see him. There he is. I'll see him. I'll see him. While we're just letting it for you to dry off, and then by the time we get it back deflated, we'll probably be a little bit drier. Full battery on the flip camera. Making chicken puffs. Are they super yummy? Yummy. And now we're making a special sauce. Ooh, can't show everyone the secret ingredients, but we can show them the chicken puffs. Yeah. Oh, hi. We'll give you a better view when they come out. 
secret sauce. And it goes on the chicken puffs. Look how golden and cheesy and crispy those look. Mm. Just like me! Yeah. <laughs>